Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even a dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And as always, if you're already subscribed, thank you so, so much for being here and welcome back. I do really appreciate all of your continued support in the form of likes and comments and those of you who spend a little part of your day with me every single day day. Today I have another Anchor of Hope box and this will be my last Anchor of Hope box for a little while, not forever, but I am going to take a little break from it just because it is one of the boxes that I do pay for out of pocket. But it looks like they are continuing their rebranding with the box itself, even though I love the blue box. I also love this very like on trend sort of chic boho palette that they're doing over on Instagram and now on this label here on this box. Anchor of Hope is $36 per month that does include the shipping or you can do what I do and do a three month subscription for $99. You can also save 10% on subscriptions or in the artist shop online using the code Noel 10. As always, I will leave all of that information for you in the description box below. You always receive each month three beautiful items that are made by artisans who are often refugees or survivors of human trafficking and they also work with companies around the globe to find awesome items to include in this box. So let's go ahead though and get into it. I just love this box because of their mission, because of the give back element to it. So the rebranding kind of continues with their like kind of dusty rose tissue paper. And I'm seeing something a little bit different here right on top. This says the Anchor of Hope Box Summer Challenge. Interesting. So we've got this cute little magnet that says never underestimate the power of hope, which is kind of their motto. It says share this magnet with someone in your life who may need to be reminded of the power of hope. Tag us with your inspiring stories on Instagram at AOHB Hope Challenge. Together, let's spread hope and change the world. So it is a really pretty, very simple sticker, which is like a little line drawing with a hand holding like a sprig of flowers. So, but I do think that's always such a great idea, obviously for their marketing, but also just, again, sharing that inspiring sense of hope with other people. I just recently pulled a card from like a stress-free deck that I got in another box. And it just reminded you that, you know, it might just be a bad day. It doesn't mean that it's a bad life. And so just reminding someone like to always have hope, uh, even when things seem a little bit hopeless or you feel like you don't have control is so wonderful. And you can do that so simply with something that's a little bit like tangible. So really cool idea. I think that's an awesome thing that they are doing. I'm gonna go ahead and tear open the tissue paper and we'll get into the box. So it looks like the product card itself has also gotten a little update. So now it's still got those same two paragraphs though, which talk about who we are and what we do. And I usually do read one of those to you just in case it's the first time you've seen Anchor of Hope on my channel, even though I think I've been opening it here for over a year now. And then on the back, also a little bit different, it does have the three paragraphs telling us about the individual items. Now they have never included the retail values, but again, you can often find these items over on the shop uh, online on their site. So I will go ahead and read the who we are paragraph this time around. So it says Anchor of Hope Box is a subscription company that commissions refugees, survivors of human trafficking and others in vulnerable situations to make handmade items. Through the dignity of work, these individuals are able to rebuild damaged and fragile lives as they work to overcome the painful situations that have brought them to this place. As we embarked on this adventure, aiming only to provide an income for these precious families, we saw something gr much greater start to happen. Through the relationships that have been building, we see the power of community happen. As people all over the world desire and purchase these handmade items, we see hope arising and it is a beautiful thing. And then I will just prop this side up facing me so that I can tell you about those individual items as we go along. So the first thing that I'm seeing right on top looks to be a jewelry piece by Esperanzart. So they've kind of combined the word Esperanza and art together and it's really pretty. So let me go ahead and pull it out of the packaging so that you guys don't hear the, see the glare says this is the bracelet trio this bracelet was made by survivors in Ecuador where traffickers can easily smuggle vulnerable women through open borders and force them into the legal industry of prostitution wow you guys this is so pretty the survivors who made this bracelet are healing through art and positive relationship building their work also helps them complete their high school education which improves their likelihood of finding a permanent career that will support their families and give them a stable future now I did see this over on Instagram they do some spoilers sometimes there and I think there are are some color variations. I am so thrilled that I got this beautiful teal color with these like um, brassy colored beads. Really, really pretty. It is actually um, 
combined at, as, at one point with this bead here so they're not like three separate bracelets that you can wear separately but I do think they look so nice together now it is a little bit big on my wrist I kind of have smaller wrists so I might actually re-gift this to someone but I'm kind of I'm gonna feel some FOMO because it is so pretty what a lovely lovely piece to start with so I do usually like the jewelry pieces that we get in Anchor of Hope box they're always some of my favorites all right, so we did get a uh, bath product, and you guys know that I am not a bath girl, so this is definitely something that I will pass along. But this does look very, very nice. It's a rose soak. It's got Himalayan sea salt, Epsom salt, rose petal marigold, and essential oils, and it's from Elijah Rising. So it says, hand-built goods that empower survivors of human trafficking. So again, just love all of these give back stories, you guys. Even though it is bath salts, which I won't use, and it sounds like it has a uh, rose scent, which is not one of my least favorite scents but it does look very nice and luxurious and it's a decent size decent sized bag so let's read about this it says this luxurious rejuvenating bath soak is made by trafficking survivors in Dallas Texas one of the primary roadblocks to recovery for survivors is lack of employment opportunities or economic empowerment these survivors work is a launching point for healing and hope and is the first step on their road to long-term rehabilitation your purchase and encouragement support uh, hopeful future for these amazing women. So love you gotta love that, right? You gotta love that. And I'm sure it smells amazing, especially if you are a fan of Rose Scents. And then finally, this is the item that I was really, really excited about when I did see it over on Instagram. And it kind of like made me rethink my decision to put my subscription on pause, but it is just so, so cute. This is a tiny little clutch. Um, I actually have something that's very similar, but it's like the larger size, but I actually love this like mini version. It says this beautiful tassel clutch comes to you from the Wayu tribe of La Guajira, Colombia. Artisans here are encouraged to share their stories and traditions in order to preserve their rich culture and every item is handmade and unique. Each product sold helps empower artisans in disadvantaged areas, raise multicultural awareness, and promote cultural preservation through economic fair trade. But look at this nice big chunky tassel. You guys know I love when a clutch has a wristlet that is so key to me actually wanting to use it. And then I just think this is so pretty. So the one I got before before was like I think in just black and white which is kind of striking but I love this neutral it definitely goes with their like rebrand but just like this natural tan color is just so pretty and soft um, so let's see how it opens so there's no like little pockets or anything inside this is really very small like I think that it would even be hard to fit some phones in just because of the curvature of it like the corners might stick out so this is really just for you know if you just have your card holder or what have you your keys and you're just running to the store maybe your phone winds up being in your pocket or you actually like leave it at home that would be that would be crazy right but it is so so sweet I think it would also be a great little thing to have like um, to help organize in a larger purse or tote bag right because you could just have those smaller things you could even use it kind of as a makeup bag especially with that material that is the lining um, it looks like it would wipe pretty clean it's mine's kind of crumpled in there but you could definitely use that as a little makeup bag as well and just have that as you're on the go with your like essentials like your lipstick and maybe your mascara if you're a mascara girl but I just think that is so cute it's a little bit smaller than I actually thought it would be but then I, I know the size of their boxes so I don't know why I'm totally surprised by that but I do think it is really sweet and I think this is a great box to end with for now again just a temporary hold but if you guys feel like you're gonna miss seeing this box on my channel just let me know in the comments below like I said I plan to bring it back eventually just giving it a little bit of a break giving my bank account a little bit of a break but I do hope that you continue to support this box if you can definitely look at their shop definitely consider the subscription I think it is a good value and again it is a fantastic mission if you did enjoy this video if you appreciated this review I would appreciate appreciate a thumbs up and hopefully I see you all very very soon in my next unboxing.